hello everyone how's it going i hope you all are doing amazing if you're new here hello welcome to my channel i'm the twitter rose nice to meet you if you're not new here hello and welcome back i'm so happy you joined me again today so today y'all i thought we should do a reading on why do people stare at you okay three piles for you to choose from today we have pile number one tiger's eye Pile number two, green gold stone. And then pile number three, blue obsidian. Okay, so I will give you a minute to choose. Also, if you didn't already, make sure to go check out your message of the day today. Um, that will be available in the community tab page Monday through Friday. Okay. All right, I hope you chose. I'm going to go right in this order. Okay. All right, so if you chose pod number one, the tiger's eye crystal, this is your reading. So let's see, why do people stare at you, okay? I do want to thank you for watching my video, and if you would like to show more support, don't forget to give this video a like. That would be appreciated. Okay, so my angels, my ancestors, my spirit team, my spirit guides, can you please get an accurate reading for pawn number one why do people stare at pawn number one okay all right so you could be out with your children a lot or maybe out with your spouse i'm getting they stare at you because they like your family they like you know your family dynamic Especially if you are married, I'm getting something about you and your husband or you and your wife um, matching in a way. This could be, you could have like the same hairstyle for like, for an example, locks. Um, <clears throat> also, I'm just, I'm getting they just like your family dynamic. They look at you and I'm like, oh my gosh, your children, they're beautiful. Oh my gosh, y'all make a beautiful couple. I'm getting that's why people stare at you. Um, yeah, especially if you're out with, you know, your person. There's something about your eyes, too, here. Some of you could have hazel eyes. You could even have, um, blue. I'm getting, like, a light-colored. Or this could even be, like, light, light, um, a light brown-colored hair. There's something here that I feel like it, it, it stands out. Um, yeah okay so let's see i feel like a lot of people are looking at you because you, you look very nice um pretty much is what i'm getting so let's see for paw one spare why do people stare at paw one okay so we have the queen of pentacles <laughs> y'all <laughs> look at this we have the king the queen and the page of pentacles oh my gosh so yeah this is you your children this is you your husband you your wife there's something here a group of three it could be three of y'all i feel like you all look alike and y'all all compliment each other like mom's hair is nice mom's dress dad's hair is nice dad's dress and even the children's hair is nice and they're dressed well so there's something about again like y'all look very well oriented a beautiful couple a beautiful family and i feel like there's an elegance with you as well because i'm being drawn to the peacocks here i feel like yeah they might hear you guys talking and they they love the way you you talk towards each other i'm also getting something about like old school as well um it could be anything y'all i know nowadays it's it's rare to see children well-mannered that is rare so there's something about that as well with this page of pentacles it's like oh my gosh your child is so so well-mannered they're so they're so behaved um so yeah that's why people are staring at you they're like oh my gosh um yeah nine of swords i feel like you got people in their head like dang i feel like they you know they're taking notes um someone here could like homeschool their children i feel like yeah there's something about an elegance with you and your family this is why people are staring at you it's very nurturing but i'm definitely getting an old school old school um parenting 
All right, so let's see. Anything else? Spirit. Someone here could also have like green eyes, light green eyes. Late, um, it could be light hazel. or Well, that's light brown. So yeah, hazel. Um, let's see. Anything else? Spirit. You guys could have like a family that one person is like really, really tall. You could be that tall person. It could be like a mom that's tall. We have Page of Wands and the Lovers. <laughs> I feel like there's something about the way you dress here. It's very, very, very elegant. Like I'm getting a masculine, you know, smells nice, dresses nice, and feminine, dresses nice, smells nice. Like that's what I'm getting. It's like your outer appearance. Yeah, and then we have the lover's card here with this page of wands. Okay, let's see. What else? Why do people stare at Paul 1? Okay. Yeah, I feel like you come off that you have like a lot of money. Um, we have <laughs> Six of Pentacles. Okay, so this landed on the King of Pentacles. I am just getting, you know, people stare a lot, majority of the time when you are out with your family. And I feel like there's something old school, like this could be maybe the masculine is the provider. So the masculine is, you know, your husband, your boyfriend, the one providing um, his debit card and paying for the groceries or, you know, he's out treating. Like there's something about y'all having like a old traditional family. And I feel like a lot of people like this. They, they... They definitely admire this and again with this king of cups i was getting there's something about y'all that is very um well mannered yeah okay let's see anything else i know this isn't really too specific like i'm just really getting you and yours we have the page and two pages here Page of Wands, Page of Cups. I feel like some some people um, could stare at you because they seen where you came from. Um, it's almost like an elevation here. Yeah, with this Empress, um, Page of Wands, and Page of Cups. I feel like they they're staring at you because they're like, dang, you have transformed. You have transformed. I remember when you were just in school, and now, wow, you have a family. So there's definitely an admiration of how you're raising your children. Um, and also what you guys wear there's definitely it's it's very clear that you um, we have making it work it's very clear that you spend money on your children and not just money you spend time with your children emotionally as well because I'm getting someone who's well mannered we have rainbow um, so some of you guys this could be like a, a same-sex marriage um, it doesn't have to be but with the rainbow card this could also be like again just you know bright like you could also have like a lot of jewelry on we have ex bestie this could be a best friend this could be why they stare at you um, I just I'm getting like a an elevation people stare at you because dang like you you transformed uh, some of you guys could have you know gotten a new partner a partner that is you know making your life full of rainbows and sunshine I've been telling you and I'm ready so yeah that's what I'm getting there's something about you making changes for yourself let me see some here I really feel like your children is really the main you could have like three boys or three uh, three daughters you could have three children though cuz I'm just getting the way y'all they all have their own different personality but it's like they're all so wow you could have triplets goodness oh my gosh good with kids so yes it's something about how you're raising your children and we have the food so some of y'all um it could be also the food you buy i was being drawn to the oranges here they're probably like oh my gosh that grocery bill <laughs> all right let's see why do people stare 
we have languages oh whistling so some of you could be from a different country that could be so this is foreign like i was picking up on like that's something old school so that could be another thing like the tradition um that you and your family carry but i feel like this is something that is like well liked it's different it's interesting and it's like oh my gosh and there's something with your clothes as well i was picking up on something like that someone here um could be jewish you could be muslim you can be from india like i'm getting there's something with a covering over your your head so yeah that's what i'm picking up on so there's also your clothing as well you could wear clothing that is you know very um you know you cover everything so it's very humble but it's like you have it in a way where it's very stylish it comes off it looks very nice you know it's like how can you not look at it um and i feel like there's accents in here definitely accents i just i feel like this is why people are staring at you they they like they like the difference um the diverse we have singing here so there's something with your voice as well people stare at you because you have a, vo a voice that is like you know very very nice very loving i'm getting like a, a high to high pitched tone um is what i'm picking up on also i'm picking up on a masculine that may have long hair i feel like people stare at you because of that they're like oh my gosh your hair looks so nice um it could be like naturally curly there's also something about you being very generous um you could you know be that one that starts something I'm, I'm just being drawn to the grocery store i'm not sure why but this is the grocery store okay so yeah i'm getting like you or the masculine here it could be your husband it could be you um there's something about you being you know you being the first one to do something this could be donating um when they ask you that question would you like to donate you know a dollar or round up to the next you know dollar and i feel like you start that there's something about you starting that or your spouse starting that um so people see you as someone very kind very generous and they see you as someone that has money and i feel like again this is why they're staring at you this is like they're questioning like oh my gosh i wonder where they're from um i feel like they're listening to the way you talk and they love this like i said there's something with your children you have very very beautiful children um yeah and i'm getting there's some like triplets or twins here something like that and they all have their own personality <laughs> all right so i think that's all i'm getting for you for pile one um, I know it's not too much descriptive, but if you would like to watch another pal or feel drawn to watch another pal, go ahead and do that, okay? Um, with that being said, love and light and bye bye Alright, if you chose pile number two, this is your reading. So let's see, why do people stare at you, pile number two? Alright, so let's see. I thank you for watching my video and if you would like to show more support, don't forget to give this video a like. That would be appreciated okay so let's see hold on let me fix my microphone y'all hold on So if you chose paw number two, the green goldstone crystal, this is your reading. So let's see, why do people stare at you, okay? Alrighty, so before we begin, I do want to thank you for watching my video. And if you would like to show more support, don't forget to give this video a like. That would be appreciated. Okay, so let's see, my angels, my ancestors, my spirit team, my spirit guides for paw number two. Why do people stare at paw number two? All right, I'm getting options. There's something about, I feel like they're questioning, like, are you on the market or something with the seven of cups here? Yeah, there's, yeah, the eight of wands here. I feel like people are staring at you because they actually want to talk to you. <laughs> That's what I'm getting with this green goldstone. So yeah, however, y'all, I am getting like this energy that you give off like this closed, <laughs> 
this closed um vibe because it is a dark crystal so there's something about you just like shielding yourself but then you know you can't see it in this camera but there this this is a glittery gold stone um it's green gold stone it has green sparkles in it so you could have like you know still trying to heal your heart here um healing your heart shocker for a wand here so yeah there's something about people wanting to come to you with offers i'm getting courtships <laughs> they want to take you out um but i feel like they're a little nervous because it's like oh this can go many ways i don't i don't know they're they're kind of fearful is what i'm getting we have six of pentacles so yeah i've i'm getting people are staring at you because um a lot of you i'm getting you do a lot of things on your own this could be you know going out grocery shopping i keep using that as an example but this is a good example so <laughs> um this could be you you know going to the car wash or um going on the walk something like that is what i'm getting but there's something about you doing things you know both of these things yourself so this could again be people are staring at you because it's like well dang do, do you know do they got a do they got a man do they got a woman like oh do this person need help um we got justice here so yeah there's them two scales again so there's something about you doing things you know carrying the load of something you know doing things by yourself doing things solo um yeah i, I feel like there's a couple people in here that kind of want to take this load off of you <laughs> um okay so let's see why do people stare at pile number two please why do people stare at pile number two we have we have knight of pentacles some of y'all y'all favorite color could be green you could wear a lot of green but with the green here I, i'm getting like people <laughs> people really want to talk to you um there's something about you i don't know like with this green i'm getting like um it's not pink which is you know more of a welcoming love kind of color it's almost like nine of pentacles it's like people kind of know that your heart is kind of shielded is what i'm getting this could be the people that know you but look we have the ace of cups here y'all this is why people want to talk to you um i do feel like there is some some quality about you that shows that you know you have a heart um, you are not this cold person. <laughs> um, yeah, the the moon card here. So it's almost like if you were trying to hide this fully, you're, you're not hiding it very well, honey. Um, <laughs> so yeah, Knight of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. I feel like people want to make a move towards you, but Knight of Pentacles, they know ooh, it's going to be some work. It's going to be some work. There's something about you being very independent, very solo. I mean, you got yourself stable situated here it's just you know your cup is empty right now and i feel like it's not empty because you you know can't get anyone it's empty because you are choosing to fill your own cup um some of you guys could be like seeking you know things that fulfill you um yeah i just feel like you do a lot of things by yourself like i mean things like i'm getting fixing the car um gardening mowing the grass or you know you take care of the house by yourself it's like people kind of know this is like a solo energy is what i'm getting um yeah it's like you're heavy in your masculine energy you can also be a feminine watching this but yeah you are heavy in your masculine energy we have queen of swords here i feel like people question if you're single seriously this is why they're staring at you um queen of swords here that's so funny i would <laughs> He was just talking about this kind of story. Okay, so like I said, there's something about your outer appearance that kind of gives off this like "don't talk to me" vibe. You could, you know, wear clothes that like hoodies. I'm picking up on hoodies, um, all black. <laughs> you are really trying to hide something here. And some of you guys are just like, I don't want no one. <laughs> um. <laughs> But yeah, I feel like people are really just staring at you because you do a lot on your own, y'all. Um, they want to talk to you. They want to know you. Yeah, Nine of Cups is like, hey, hey, do you need a hand? Do you need a hand? <laughs> Some of you, you could have, um, you can have red hair. You can have red hair. You can have blue eyes. Alright, 
anything else, Spirit, for pile number two, please and thank you. We have five of pentacles. I feel like a lot of y'all really, y'all are not in this energy. This is all a facade is what I'm getting. It's like you have this motive. All right, I'm just going to be in and out. And because y'all know y'all look good, y'all got to cover yourselves up and y'all want to just hide. Like, <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm, I'm picking up on this, like, <laughs> y'all really making this a thing. <laughs> so y'all don't have no one come to towards you. Um, that is so funny. Okay, so yeah, this, see how this is a queen though? She has her crown. Um, there's something again just about you being in like this dominant energy. Okay, so why do people stare? Y'all, I'm not going to lie with this Ace of Cups. I do sometimes see this as like an evil eye. Yeah, sometimes like. So I feel like people can question like, oh, they don't have this. They don't have that. But it's really is a facade. You have everything. You just, you know, you making it seem like you don't. This could also be towards people that need money. I feel like you, you just, you want to stay away from everyone. I don't blame you. All right, so let's see. Why do people stare at Pawan? There is something about you ha being confident, though. Um, yeah, because both of their heads are up, and I'm just these are both queens here. So we got Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords here, and we have cooking. We have Bible knowledge. Ooh, so you can be also religious. <laughs> that could be it. why you're so closed off some of you guys might be celibate you just you know maybe waiting for the one here i feel like you have a lot of suitors though like i'm getting suitors people want to talk to you um they want to oh court you. that's probably why i was getting court that was like more of a um formal way of asking someone out so yeah that could be that um yeah bible knowledge here i feel like you kind of show that you're very religious or you know you walk by faith for some this could be you know what people are looking for so this could be why you know they're staring at you like oh i know this person is you know um they're gonna talk to me if i know you know the bible verses and psalms you know stuff like that we have telling funny jokes that's so funny because i'm picking up on a humor with you so <laughs> Oh my gosh. So yeah, if you stare, you you could be like that loud person on the phone is what I'm getting. That person that's, you know, on the phone with their best friend and they just going at it loud as heck. Everyone's all in your conversation. Um I feel like you you're very sarcastic and um you tell funny jokes. We have baker and we have cooking and baker. So there's something about you also like the way you smell. I'm getting you could work maybe at like a bakery or you could like cook different kind of spices different kind of herbs you you smell like that so i feel like this is another reason why people smell like you they're like oh what did they just make you know um yeah that's what i'm getting it's so funny because i never knew like ice cream had a smell this is off topic y'all but i used to work at dairy queen when i was young when i was like 16 so and it's so funny i remember when i got in a car and my dad was like you smell like the ice cream there and i'm like really and it's so funny when i walk in dairy queen you do smell like ice cream so yeah there's something about you know the things you you cook with it, you smell like it so they're like oh she knew how to cook oh he know how to cook um yeah <laughs> okay why do people stare we have being kind so yeah y'all definitely y'all are nice people and that's so funny this queen of swords i was talking about it today with my girly on here um that's so funny she picks this pile too <laughs> um anyway with the queen of swords we was talking about how this is a baddie she's a baddie but on the outside she tries to play tough but i feel like she only does this because she has just been hurt so many times so the only thing she can do is really just stand her guard she gotta show like she's not afraid of anything anyone she's not but she can be ruthless for sure for sure but there's something about a facade here people really like hmm are they you know are they nice or something like <laughs> i'm getting people a little scared of you but then when they hear you talk or something they're like oh this person's actually nice and this person's actually beautiful oh my gosh this person's handsome like that's what i'm getting they almost kind of like have to take a double look here because it's like whoa i wasn't expecting that all right let's see anything else 
there. <laughs> that is so funny. Y'all are funny. This pile is funny. All right, okay. Hold on. There's one that fell, y'all. Hold. Oh my gosh. Look, look what fell out. Lie. You can't even see it. But liar, y'all. Didn't I say there's something about a facade here? Y'all is not fooling anyone. Okay. Um, we have step parent and we have glowing so some of you could take care of you know um people as well um so they might stare you like oh you look familiar you could be like heavy into church um let's see anything else spirit we have shine i've seen shine bright so yeah there's something about your energy still glowing you know even though you're trying to make it seem like it's not we have low standards a lot of attention so yeah i feel like a lot of you guys are just kind of hiding right now but it's like people are staring at you because it's like you are definitely showing you hiding like you got a hoodie over your face a hat a cap all this stuff like i'm getting fake mustache fake <laughs> i'm kidding but um yeah there's the thing about you really just trying to hide and be off the market y'all we have red passion and deep so i feel like you are really deep down a lover um and you just haven't met anyone on a soul level so yeah i do feel like people really these are the people that staring at you it's because they want to talk to you and you know they want to talk to you but i feel like you know you just you looking for something you know stable is what i'm getting so yeah you're gonna play hard to get um, I feel like some of you guys could have like a really nice body as well. I was picking up on like a butt, a hips and stuff like that. And I'm getting with someone, um, you could have be like very muscular. Yeah, I'm getting very muscular. Like there's something about you being built here with the seven of pentacles. I'm getting like how, you know, this is, this is stability right here. This is, you've been working on something. It's like something's showing like, Ooh, you know, you look good. All right, so I think that's all I have for you, pile number two. If this resonated with you, feel free to let me know. Um, with that being said, love and light and bye-bye. All right, so if you chose pile number three, the blue obsidian crystal, this is your reading. So let's see why do people stare at you, okay? All right, so before we begin, I do want to thank you um, for watching my video. And if you would like to show more support, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. That would be very much appreciated. Alrighty. Okay, so my angels, my ancestors, my spirit team, my spirit guides, can you please come forward and help me provide an accurate reading, please, and thank you for pile number three, the blue obsidian crystal. Why do people stare at them? Please and thank you. We have four of pentacles. Hmm. Four of Pentacles, let's see. Some of you, I'm getting like something when, like being in a hurry, a rush. Um, you could be someone that, you know, when you walk in a store, you, you are speeding through, speeding through with that Four of Pentacles though they were holding them pinnacles like tightly so i feel like you could be someone um that's into like saving you can be into couponing um so you know you that one that's carrying you know that bag <laughs> that bag with them coupons in it um savings like i'm getting something like that i feel like you save a lot though like you save very well um yeah okay so let's see why do people stare at you i feel like there is i'm getting the message of don't judge a book by its cover so there is a message of people you know assuming things with that four of pentacles um dang i should have i should have took that four of pentacles out um there's something about people assuming like oh this person must not have it you know this person must be without i'm getting there's something with you saving oh there it is there's something with you like saving this four of pentacles here it's like you keeping money to yourself um you are saving for something big something special the nine of swords here um i do feel like people stare at you because it's like they they almost wonder if you're struggling or something i'm not getting you are i'm just getting you are prioritizing um it's a different term that they're not using is what i'm getting they're making assumptions 
yeah the star card here it's almost like you have this quality but it's like hmm they're judging like oh they're wearing they're wearing these or they've been wearing the same jeans like i'm getting like something like that y'all okay why do people stare why do people stare at you for pile number three Ooh, we have six of wands so yeah it's like there's something about you having like the quality of being you know known um shining um being popular with the six of wands here i feel like a lot of you really don't like the wrong attention there's something about you you know i feel like you wouldn't mind being known but it's like yeah there's something about you just just trying to do things the right way here the nine of swords it's like i'd rather i'd rather just sit here and deal with my problems before i jump into anything else or try to take from other people like there's something about like a humbleness with you but like people just assume that you know you don't have based off your outer appearance here but it's like really six of wands like you actually have a lot of success you are actually very successful um yeah some of you could you know you might not spend money that much on like you know materialistic things um or maybe you know right now you're choosing not to like i was getting something with saving why do people stare why do people stare at pile number three spirit all right i feel like some of you guys may look tired sometimes um yeah with this nine of swords it's almost like yeah like maybe you had trouble sleeping i'm getting something like that we have the knight of pentacles all right for some of you i'm getting you could wear like a mask like that's what i'm getting it's almost like people are questioning hmm there's a lot of assumptions in this reading like i'm instantly getting that um so i feel like people assume but they actually don't know nothing they know nada okay we have nine the knight of pentacles i'm being drawn to the shield over their face here so i feel like some of you could you know wear a mask um and there's nothing wrong with wearing a mask y'all but i know like now it's not as you know people aren't prioritizing it now i'm one of them i'm guilty okay sometimes i do wear my mask but yeah there's something about you wearing your mask like everywhere you go um yeah nothing wrong with that okay so yeah i feel like people are like oh my gosh are they sick or are, are they sick like why are they wearing a mask you know covid covid was so you know <laughs> i don't what year did it start 2020 oh man okay let's see some of y'all could also be like top heavy um yeah you can be like top heavy like a chest i'm getting something about like you covering your chest i feel like a, a lot of you hide what you have and it's not because you don't have it it's just because it's like you don't want the wrong oops hold on y'all all right you don't want the wrong attention is what i'm getting i just seen 34 44 so 444 could be significant here there is this energy of being very humble um like no one will guess what you have you know in that savings no one gonna guess what you got you know um brewing right now thank you yeah the emperor exactly i feel like a lot of you are you know you could be struggling right now anxious right now <laughs> that's all about to change okay you got the world card here so yeah i feel like people are staring at you too because they see the success within you it's almost like it's it's kind of hard to you know see a star without their light you know you are that you are that six of wands you are this emperor this star there's something about you having a destiny that is going to be powerful i feel like you are going to make a lot of changes and this could also be the way you move the way you walk i'm getting there's something about the way you walk here um yeah 
I feel like you walk very proudly, but some of you guys could like have this fast pace. You could also talk very, very fast as well with the Nine of Swords here. Yeah, you might talk very fast as well. Um, okay, so let's see. Some of you could be into, every time I see this emperor, I always think of him as a wizard. Some of y'all could be into like, you know, um, spirituality where you express yourself in that way as well you know you wear I don't know what they're called I keep saying that this is like the third video I did and I say I don't know what they mean and that, this is what I'm channeling I'll have to look it up but there's something about them cloths that you wear um, is what I'm getting you could also have your hair covered a lot you could wear crystals um, yeah I'm getting like shaman very old school very old souls when I'm getting night the knight of cups yeah look there's that hierophant so yeah there's something about you the way you move is very traditional um and it's also very different the knight of pentacles here yeah I feel like people just assume assume a lot with you some of y'all could have like facial hair that's like a different color than your um actual hair your, your um your hair on top of your head is what i'm getting i'm just being drawn to the emperor's face here so yeah nine of pentacles there's something about you it's like you can come into work with you know looking dingy looking crazy but it's like the way you style it it's like Ooh, that's actually nice like I feel like you are kind of a um a trend uh, what is it called a trend setter like I feel like you can mix things and make it into something seriously you have a quality that is it's <laughs> you can wear whatever you want wear whatever you want and you still gonna make it look popping like seriously I do feel like you guys do not like you're not focused on materialistic things we have the tempers the temperance here and the chariot so yeah just there's something about you just the way you walk the way you move people stare like ooh, it's like something different it's almost like they know Some of you could also wear like a lot of um, maybe like barrettes, it could be flowers, something in your hair. This could also be hair jewelry. I know they have that for like locks, for um, braids, and stuff like that is what I'm getting. So you could also wear that. So there's something about that coming up in here as well that the way you, the accessories that you wear, it's, it's very, um, it complements you, okay? That's what I'm getting, yeah, especially with that emperor. Um, I was getting, you know, crystals, necklaces, anklets, bracelets, toe rings. You could also have rings. But y'all, look, this is a perfect example right here. I'm going to use me as an example. My nails is not done, right? But I'm still, I still got my rings on, you know? It's almost like you can come into work, you know, dressed up, dolled up, but your hair is not done. Like, you know what I mean? Like, that's what I'm getting. But you will still look nice, you know? Um, you will still be shining, popping. Um, yeah, so let's see. Why do people stare at you? I feel like they see like all the different things that you can do with yourself seriously it's like like it's almost like they want to style you or something we have computer games some of you guys could come off like nerdy um nothing wrong with that i love a good nerd okay i'm nerdy we have decorating homes so yeah like i said it's like the accessories you wear people stare like oh that's nice where'd you get that from definitely getting you wear like antique things we have reading so <laughs> so yeah there's something about a, a nerdy look here you could have glasses oh that can be another thing you could wear different kinds of glasses yes we have math so yeah there's something about um you looking educated okay you looking educated you look like you do not really care um you know about being in what is it name brand stuff like it's like i can care less i mean i feel like you would like it but it's like there's also something about you not wanting to attract too much attention here but i feel like again there's 
this, I think you like this. Like, I want to say this is a very humble energy and the Six of Wands here. It's like, again, people see like, oh my gosh, she could, he could really do this. She could really do that. Like, there's almost like people want to come in and style you. Like, I'm getting style your hair. You could maybe wear like the same hairstyle or something. I feel like you could have long hair. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like you could wear your hair like this or let me do your hair like that. Like, we have magic tricks. <laughs> Like I said, I was picking up on a wizard here. So you could be, again, you know, heavy into spirituality, okay? Using them divination tools. So I have, I feel like people see like, oh, this person's, you know, witch or something. <laughs> um, I'm laughing, y'all, because this term is used so negatively. So it's so funny when, you know... <laughs> people are so uneducated and i'm like a witch you are a witch like what like it, it's silly stuff anyway but yeah there's something about you giving that impression okay um so yeah i feel like there's a lot of assumptions in here too people assume like oh what are they into we have health here as well so some of y'all could be like really um into taking care of your health so you could be like gym oops you could be gym junkies hold on y'all these keep falling what the world Okay, so I'm gonna put those back because, like, goodness, they just keep falling. So let's see, anything else here for pile number three? All right, we have looking forward, mm -hmm. very close and fixed. So yeah, with this fixed here, y'all could be like a fixed sign. Um, however, with the fixed here, I just feel like a lot of people want to doll you up, seriously. They stare at you because you have amazing qualities. The way you look, your skin, um, your hair, your body, it's almost like anything could really compliment you. And I feel like a lot of y'all don't show that, you know, they don't, you don't show like, oh my gosh like um for any of my feminines you know out here like for example i'm gonna use me again as an example v-neck shirts i personally do not wear them because i do not have a chest but someone that does you know say you do have a chest and you know people like oh my gosh she could rock a v-neck you know like i'm getting examples like that um and for my masculine something with your facial hair as well um or you know body in general so yeah there's something about that okay uh i feel like you're very handsome very beautiful and people probably think that you don't know that i don't think that at all i just feel like you don't want to attract a lot of attention there's nothing wrong with that okay so i think that's all i have for you pawn number three if this resonated with you feel free to let me know um feel free to comment feel free to subscribe and that would be amazing um with that being said love and light and bye, -bye.